Hi, it's Miss Suter, and we're going to sound out CVC words using a rainbow. As we spell out k and start at the green, follow the rainbow to the stop sign. K and k and can. Let's try it again with pug. P ug. Ready? Start at the green. P ug. P ug. Pug. Let's keep going. Bus. B us. B us. Bus. Pig. P ig. Follow the rainbow. Pig. This is a picture of wet. W, e, t, e, e is e wet. Next is pen. P, e, n, pen. The last picture is a box. See if you can spell that one by yourself. B, a, x. Now we're going to put words together to make a sentence. So find a sentence that matches the image. This is a picture of a rabbit. So first I'll say the rabbit is in the grass. And then I would type or write out that sentence. The rabbit is in the grass. Make sure you have a period. There are other sentences I can make too. Like, I see one rabbit period i see one rabbit i wonder how you could change that sentence or add on to it like i see one rabbit in the grass i don't know maybe you could think of different ways to write that all right i have another sentence i see the mm, flowers period I see the flowers. Again, maybe you were thinking of some different words. How can you make sentences that are different than mine using these words? Comment below. All right, now I'm going to write, or type in my case, a paragraph, which is three to five sentences about the rabbit. So far I've got, I can see a rabbit in the grass. It is very cute and it has big brown eyes. It's, now that is, it's like it is. So it is what? It is, it is sitting in the grass, hmm. Its fur is brown. Notice I took out the apostrophe because I don't want to say it is fur is brown. I want to say its fur is brown like I'm describing it. So that's why I took out the apostrophe because the apostrophe means it is. I can see a rabbit in the grass. It is very cute and it has big brown eyes. Its fur is brown too, T-O-O, -O, like also too. I wonder if the rabbit likes to eat the yellow flowers. I also wonder, oh, that's a mistake. Let's fix it. I also wonder if those flowers are daffodils. Oh, 
I made this a long time ago. Those are not daffodils. I think I meant to say dandelions. So I answered my question. No, they're not. What can you tell about the rabbit? Or maybe you have a story. Here's a story that I have. There was once a rabbit named Chester. He loved to eat orange things like carrots and cheese. Chester was my pet bunny and one day he went to play outside. I took him out of his cage and carried him outside. Chester loved sniffing the grass and yellow flowers. I bet they smelled good. Before I knew it, Chester was hopping away faster than a cheetah. He was so fast I couldn't catch him. I hope Chester comes back soon. P.S. This is not a true story. Thanks for watching and writing with me.